1863. Civil war rages in the east. An unclaimed wealth of natural resources beckons prospectors to the west. Far from and between it all, a gunman stalks the territories on a divine mission to kill American settlers. He would elude governors and armies, bounty hunters and posses, until his demise at the climax of a fierce high country manhunt. By then, Felipe Espinosa had claimed more than 30 lives to quietly become one of the nation's first serial killers and foreign terrorists. The Vendetta of Felipe Espinosa is a novelization of a bizarre, dark, little known series of events in American history. In the summer of 1863, two men went on a killing spree in the mountains of Colorado. Their names were Felipe and Vivian Espinosa. Not a whole lot is known for sure about who he was as a person or what made him do what he did. Um, what is known is that summer, he and his younger brother killed 32 American settlers. The story begins along what would eventually become the Colorado-New Mexico border. This is where Felipe was raised as a young boy. Once the killing spree started, Felipe and his younger brother would move northward along the Rocky Mountains towards central Colorado. So there weren't a lot of people living in this part of the country at the time. So when the killing started, there was naturally a lot of paranoia that just rippled across the territory. Uh, no one knew who was doing the killings. They thought it might have been Indians. They thought it was Confederates, guerrilla bands of Confederates. Um, innocent people were actually hanged um, under this false suspicion of uh, strangers coming into these isolated mining camps. At this point, Colorado Governor John Evans commissioned a man named Tom Tobin to finish the job. Tobin was a very renowned, successful uh, bounty hunter, army scout, and trapper. He was a close friend of Kit Carson, and when it came down to it, he was the best man to finish the job. And once Tobin picked up Felipe's trail, what would happen next would be one of the most uh, exciting, bloody manhunts in early American history.